Now, just a day before Taiwan goes to presidential polls, China has called out Taiwan's presidential candidate as a severe danger who would threaten peace by following the evil path of independence. The frontrunner candidate Vice President Lai ching te has portrayed himself as a defender of Taiwan's democracy but has drawn iri from China in the past over comments about independence of Taiwan. China's Taiwan Affairs Office said in a statement that if Lai comes to power, he will further push for Taiwan independence, separatist activities and create turbulence in the Taiwan Strait. China's warning on Lai comes after Washington announced it plans to send an official delegation to Taiwan after the election, a move that drew sharp rebuke from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs in Beijing. The provisions of the three China-U.S. joint communiques cautiously and properly handle Taiwan-related issues, stop official exchanges with Taiwan, stop sending any wrong signals to the separatist forces advocating for Taiwan independence, and refrain from intervening in the elections in the Taiwan region in any form, so as to avoid causing serious damage to China-U.S. relations, as well as to peace and stability across the Taiwan Strait. Now, this election is being closely watched by the United States as the polls will also shape future relations between Beijing and Washington, D.C. On the other hand, presidential candidate Hua Yuiha said that he will not sell out Taiwan to China, pledging to maintain a strong relationship with staunch ally the United States if elected. Taiwanese Foreign Minister Joseph Wu criticized China's repeated interference in the election. Wu posted on social media platform X, stating, and I'm quoting from his post, Taiwan's upcoming elections are in the international spotlight and repeated interference steals the focus. Frankly, Beijing should stop messing with other countries' elections and hold their own.